I'm from uh, Singapore. I come from uh, the operator Singtel. I'm responsible for the radio network in the uh, whole of Singapore. So I plan the 2G network, the 3G network, and we also uh, trial new technology like LTE, uh, which we've been doing since uh, last year. And what we shall do to them today then is to continue those, those stairways to heaven on the HSPA steps, and that is new. It's that uh, 42 megabits per second on a single carrier. Uh, we will do 84 megabits on a dual carrier, and then uh, later in the afternoon we will continue to do this even on even more carriers. So click on it. On the meter here you can see the, the throughput. I think this is the first in the world that uh, uh, Nerickson has reached this uh, very major milestone. Uh, it's, it's really pushing the envelope and uh, it is always an honour to witness a very historic event, especially one that is the first in the market. So I'm, I'm very pleased to be here to share this moment with uh, uh, Ericsson. What will this mean for you as an operator in the end? Um, well, this means that uh, as operator especially, it means that you have now more options whether you want to go down uh, the HSPA road or uh, go down the LTE road, uh, you, you now have a lot of choices to, to make. So what about Singtel? How will Singtel differentiate itself through these means? I think Singtel um, does not just look at the, the, just the speed. Of course, speed is a very important parameter for us, um, but speed alone can be easily matched by our competitor. So in Singapore, we are looking at um, adding a lot of multimedia services over uh, our mobile broadband network in order to differentiate ourselves. So for example, one great example is our video streaming. We have a live video streaming of our Barclays Premier League soccer match, which is very popular in Singapore. So users can really watch live soccer games on their iPhone, on their uh, Android phones. and. Um, this is kind of uh, application and differentiation that we want to bring to our customers uh, on top, uh, besides having a very fast uh, throughput. <laughs> you are actually the first non Ericsson person who sees this demonstration. This is what we will show in Barcelona two weeks from now. Uh, as much as possible, we try to uh, partner with Ericsson in our success because uh, in order to win with our customers, uh, we need to also have to have a good win-win relationship with our vendors and in this respect I think so far Ericsson has been a very strong partner and like I said they share with us the vision of uh, leading and shaping the market.